Hi, this is Zikru Fahey from Spectral Audio. And today I'd like to show you what's included in the latest 1.3 update for AstroGen Max for Live Edition. AstroGen is a MIDI pattern generator, which lets you create melodies using one of the eight different algorithms and manipulate these patterns in many different ways. It's an incredibly useful tool in studio and on stage. After releasing the first batch of the AstroGen Hardware Edition, we decided it would be a great idea to port some of the new features that we first introduced in the hardware version back into the Max for Live device. The main new feature in 1.3 is that Acigen can now hold steps in order to generate longer notes. This feature was added to the hardware version a couple of days before the first units were shipped but had an incredibly positive effect on Astrogen's pattern generation, as it can now generate much more interesting and organic sequences. You can set the probability of generating longer notes via the whole possibility tweak available in the Tweaks tab. You can also set it to zero in order to make Acigen generate 16th note patterns, like in previous versions. Acigen can now add randomness to the bass velocity via the random velocity tweak. This is different from adding a velocity device after Acigen to randomize the velocity because it lets you add velocity variation to the different notes inside a pattern without having to randomize them every time a note gets played. The subtle difference has a huge impact when working with genres that rely on precise repetition, such as techno. Keyboard Shift is now available in the Max for Live version, and it allows you to transpose the pattern via MIDI. To enable, activate Keyboard Shift in the Options view and send a MIDI node into the Acigen via a MIDI controller or a MIDI sequence. Notes higher than middle C will transpose the sequence upwards, while notes lower than middle C will transpose the sequence downwards. You can try using Keyboard Shift to make Acigen behave similarly to an arpeggiator. Keep in mind that if the Pulse Quantizer is enabled, all the notes will be quantized to the selected key and scale, even after being transposed. The 1.3 update also includes other bug fixes and improvements to the pattern generation and manipulation. For more information about Acigen, both software and hardware versions, visit spectroaudio.com. And as always, thanks for watching.